American Chronicles, The Art of Norman Rockwell. So no, what we're looking at is, is you know, uh, the Rockwell's uh, triple self-portrait. You know, there is the, there is the funny self-depreciating Rockwell. His, his back is to us. We're seeing perhaps a more unflattering portion of his anatomy and that awkward pose as he's leaning forward. We see a little more opaque Rockwell reflected back in the mirror with his glasses. We can't even see his eyes. And then there's the Rockwell that's emerging on the canvas who actually looks a little more young, looks more handsome, and is uh, addressing us directly with his eyes. Which, which one is the real Rockwell? The next gallery will be all about uh, the issue of families, using the family as a kind of a platform for storytelling. And that's right around the corner over here. We're now, I'm now coming into the uh, gallery that, that, that features a number of uh, paintings uh, that Rockwell uh, where Rockwell featured images of families. And probably one of the most famous is this marvelous uh, Christmas homecoming here of 1948, where you can see a, um, and, and understand that 1948, it's uh, three years after the uh, armistice, so the no notion of homecoming, coming home, uh, is still very much a kind of a poignant emotional issue for, for Americans. The last gallery dealt with the subject of families. This gallery deals with the subject of childhood and more in particular uh, with this series of paintings, uh, the transition from childhood fantasy to more adult knowledge and really creating some of the more poignant images in uh, the exhibition. Rockwell was America's great artist of the home front. Rockwell created this marvelously satisfying image of a family Thanksgiving dinner. Uh, my mother, Florence Mary Lindsay, uh, is on the right side of the picture as the viewer looks at it. And she has her head facing towards the viewer full, um, more fully than any other of those on that right side. And she has dark, dark hair. And she was 16 at the time when the picture was, when she sat for the photograph of the picture. Across the table from her is her father, and he is Charles Lindsay. His head is balding on the top, he, and uh, you can't see much of his face as much as you can see hers. At the head of the table, I, Norman Rockwell's maid with a turkey, and his postman, um, who is the grandfather-looking fellow at the at top of the table. The others are neighbors and friends um, in the area of Arlington, Vermont. So in the final gallery, we feature 323 original post covers, starting as early as 1916 and ending up in the 1960s. So we invite our visitors at the end of the show to linger here.